welcome to my video i'm jennifer roberts you're catching me either on my youtube channel true divine 44 or my facebook page true divine 44 like share subscribe and comments on either or both of those platforms is greatly appreciated and much more love to everybody who's done that thus far i really appreciate you all so i'm putting out as much free content as i can mainly via tarot to help support guide and inspire whoever wants to be supported guided and inspired so i'm putting out daily energy readings as much as i can um circumstances especially right now permitting with two young active boys and i'm putting out monthly tarot readings for each sign so they'll be coming up real soon um from month to month they go up so you, and you can always refer back to them throughout the month um to just to just check in and see if things are resonating with you a little bit more as time passes by um, so enjoy take what you will because i'm picking up a collective of energies i'm translating those via tarot so because it's general some of it might resonate with you some days and some of it might resonate with you other days um or it might all not resonate with you some days so just take what helps you take what guides you and leave the rest behind so for the 27th of the 4th 2020 we have got the page of fire this um energy is active forward moving look into the future um there's a real for a lot of people there's been a real shift a real turn about a real change in the wants out of life what what you want to create how you want to live who you want to be with what you want to be doing um so there's this real hey theodore so there's this real desire to go forward with these new wants with these new creative ideas and inspirations um you know this speaks of messages going to to help you go forward um messages of confirmation of that you're going on the right path um things that just help bolster what you have an idea about what you want to do um so that could be coming in today for a lot of you and that you've had a a, a, a burning a desire um that is getting more and more and up to up to today where you're ready to move forward with it you want to you want to be moving with something and it's this creative fiery passionate um want new want from something maybe even adapting an old idea adapting the way you are in an old relationship even but making it a new want a new something or going for something absolutely brand new um, creating something absolutely brand new um, for your life going forward so there's a real shift a real change um, this guy you know it it speaks of um, even moving away moving from moving from different lo moving locations sorry uh, even going forward that way as in moving uh, to a home um, a business um, it talks about travel and it's physical travel um so there's a lot of um passion behind that wanting to get that done wanting to move forward with it somehow wanting to put some things in action to know that you can just rest to know that it's going forward some way somehow even in a small way today you want to start that ball in ball in motion now i know in the current circumstances the way things are shut down and locked down that seems very difficult um to be moving forward somehow physically i.e your new home don't doubt the universe don't doubt yourself don't doubt the powers of your manifestation to move mountain mountains to get away from obstacles and somehow get around them um, a lot of you will be finding that where you thought current circumstances were going to stop your plans dead, were going to stop you from going forward the way you plan to go forward, that actually there's a way around it that makes it a hell of a lot easier and a hell of a lot cheaper. Um, it, but there's those, for, that's for those people who have enough burning desire and, uh, and a, the least amount of doubt in self. That, that those things do just move those moving parts just get into place and 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 you know line up for you as you go forward it's the energy of not being afraid of the unknown um just wanting to go for it wanting to try wanting to see um and it's a little bit of the attitude of today to say well i'm not doing anything else so I may as well 
you know, anything that I was doing in the old ways, i.e. the old way I was working, going to work, isn't working right now. It's been locked down, shut down. So take advantage of that energy instead of swimming in that energy of being the victim, being, you know, locked down, shut out of your old life. Start making moves to go around these constructs, to go around these obstacles, to make make a path for others also to follow suit from you to to go forward to to hit those targets to um be, be achieve what you want to achieve uh so the second card is talking about passion again but it's the cups um and this speaks of balance a lot of you have have are, are feeding off the universal energy today which seems quite calm um in that and and you're balancing out there's this softness to you today whereas so it's a real diverse day because there's this fiery passion there's this fiery wanting to go forward move forward energy but also imbalance and and that's probably how you're manifesting the the path through any obstacles the path through any mountains or around any mountains because you're not triggered by those obstacles in this energy you stay in balanced you stay in in harmony you're not allowing anything that seems like an obstacle at first to knock you off kilter and, and knock your manifestation out um so this balance is really important and it speaks a lot to a lot of you have found where you early on in this as what's going on right now that shall not be named Early on, you were finding that you, the realization of being with the wrong people, being with the wrong tribe, being with the wrong business partners, just finding that you don't fit that space anymore. There's been a real transition up to today, which is really good news for a lot of you in that the, you're ready to just go forward now because you're ready to go forward with the tribe, the people, the person, the business partners that you've met along the way that feel right, that fit right, that just lift you up feed you that don't bring you down that don't limit you so there's this moving forward but in a balanced way just uh, just working with the universe today taking those physical steps to make something change something move forward something some way go forward but at the same time staying balanced not being triggered into oh no it's never going to happen kind of thing if you, the first obstacle that you come across because the balance in this two of cups is really beautiful it's keeping you in harmony it's keeping you in that space of real powerful manifestation um because you seem to be just above any trigger points above any kind of um drag you down points you're just in a different vibration a different frequency today if this resonates with you which is awesome because that's exactly exactly how you 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 make your own timeline you make your own reality you move out of a reality that's been constructed by others for us to live in and be controlled in and be limited in um and so it's brilliant to feel this energy coming back at me of, of these people these individuals my brothers my sisters finding their space finding their passion getting to the point of being fed up and instead of tilting into victimhood tilting towards the, the forward movement with this fire in your heart with this fire in your tummy to go forward but having learned to to the worst has happened so you're just balanced you're not worried about the unknown um because the unknown has sort of already happened you know you weren't expecting your business to be shut down you weren't expecting to be locked down with people that you thought you were going to spend the rest of your life with but realize that this isn't living um and instead of being that victim there's been this movement forward this growth and this expansion real balance so the third card is the five of wands but it's in reverse and there's this feeling that you know when you're when you've expanded when you've grown when you've leveled up when you do find that you just don't fit the environment or the people that you're around that you're with or you don't fit in the constructs that you've been forced to live in um 
you'll find that there's that period of time where the people around you want to bring you back to the level that they're used to seeing you at, that they're used to be able to maybe um, take advantage of you at or get what they want out of you at or just make themselves feel better about themselves because maybe in some way somehow they are more organized or have been more leveled up than you up until now because instead of doing the inner work a lot of you have people around you that have absolutely um, made fun of that idea made fun of you know inner work it's the inner work that reflects on the outside not the other way around um, Whereas you've gone away and been doing the inner work, been doing that balancing out, that recalibration, that cleansing, that lifting up of self. Um, there is this interim period of where a lot of you will have this type of person or these type of people around you that will want to drag you back to where they're comfortable, to where they're comfortable seeing you at, where, where they feel um, that they can make themselves feel better by um, seeing you as, as a down and out, seeing you as a victim, seeing you as vulnerable, um, make themselves feel bigger, that they can toss you a coin every now and again. But you're on a path where you'll never need those coins again from those people. You'll never need the crumbs that they can throw you again. So there will be a little bit of frustration from these people that are around you or this person that is around you. Um, they may try everything that they can to trigger you out of this two of cups, to turn this two of cups upside down and imbalance you and knock you off this passionate moving forward path. So I don't think you even need this advice if this resonates with you today, um, but I'll give it. Let them throw these arrowy, fiery arrows but let it do nothing else other than spur you on and speed you up and and re remind you of how much you've grown, how much you've expanded, how much wisdom you have gained over this time. And keep your cups upright, keep them in balance. Don't let anybody, anything on the outside imbalance your cups today. You just keep making those moves, keep moving forward without even being affected by these. On the bottom of the deck, there is this Queen of Cups. Now it's in reverse and it speaks to the energy I'm picking up for a lot of you in the Five of Wands reversed of this narcissistic type energy who likes their, um, likes their people, whether it's a partner, whether it's a friend, um, in a certain place. Um, often, for a lot of you, this person has seemingly saved you, seemingly helped you, seemingly um, done everything for you. But then for years after that, you've always been reminded of that. You've always been reminded that you almost owe them. Um, and so instead of freeing yourself all those years ago with whatever you feel this person helped you out with, with that saved you from, you just went from one trap into another. And so you're freeing yourself of this today. Today more than all of the other days, I feel. Um, and that could cause some, some fiery ones to be shot out by this narcissistic energy. Uh, this energy is intolerant of um, not getting its own way, um, not having its own say, not having a whole load of control over everything and everyone um, that is in its circle. So, you know, again, let that be nothing but a reminder of how much you've grown, how much wisdom you've gained, how much um, unlike you are to this person. You're unrecognisable to this person now because all of a sudden, all of that inner work, all of that growth, that expansion, that cleansing out of the system has been making its way to the surface this surface the skin surface and now it's it's shining out of you that you are balanced you are whole you are in love with self and you are able to lift yourself up and keep yourself on the straight path um that's shining out of you today and that is your force field from this energy 
you know you just don't you don't don't let any of these ones even penetrate that false field because the work that you've done you don't deserve to have that burst or penetrated by any of these ones just let them bounce off you and in that you're starting the ball more the ball moving forward anyway because this person is getting further and further and further away out of your consciousness out of your mind out of your physical space just by you making those steps forward just moving forward doing something anything the smallest thing today to the biggest thing so it's a great energy today it's an awesome energy it's the 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 start of the recognition of all of the inner work that a lot of you have been doing um individually and collectively and this is exactly these are the type of energies that we need to move forward into a timeline that we can enjoy that we can really live in that we can really um grow in and not just exist in and be controlled in so you know it's an it's an awesome day today it's an awesome energy today and you've got this you've got this absolutely you've got this um, so that's for the 27th of the 4th, 2020. I'll be back tomorrow. If you would like a private reading, you can book with me with any of the details above or below this video, depending on where you're watching it. Um, you can message me on Facebook Messenger at True Divine 44 Again, if you led to, please like, subscribe and share. It helps. It helps a lot. Um, and until tomorrow, much love. Be happy, be whole, always. Mwah.